Okay, now the next thing that we need to do, gather all our parts together. Look at our, look at the schematics. I'm gonna put these on the video, this on the video link, and you can download this little schematic. What we have to do, we're gonna make the board. In this box, I have a place for an LED, which let's just you know, let's get it in spot right here. Drill it out so that the LED fits. And you can use a little bit of super glue to glue it in spot, okay, once it's in there. And uh, so I want the, uh, the board to fit on the on inside just like this, nicely flush there. The battery fits. You can put it in either way. It'll, it should just fit right in there. And no, hold that. Basically, there's a little bit of space, a little bit of wiggle room there. It's fine. And should be room enough to close. You need a box or a case or something this size or bigger. It's fine. Not going to hurt anything to be b bigger. But uh, needs to be able to fit the battery in so you can change the battery when you need without breaking wires. So you'd be able to pull this out, pop it off, and replace the battery. Okay, so start off. This will be the, the let's call it the output. This will be the output wire. So we're gonna go backwards. We have a, uh, where's my close, close glasses? <laughs> All right, this is, this is 22 at 50, okay. The calculation says 2.2 is fine, but 22 bring us, bring us down to about 0.5 hertz. <laughs> as long as you don't have any DC in the, in the input. So we're gonna put the plus. Now, a lot of, a lot of uh, laptop uh, microphones, you know, you just plug straight into the, 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 the um, or, come on. Uh, sound cards, okay? S just standard sound cards. Today, in today's computers, they're very good. So, uh, and they provide a little phantom power to a little plug microphone like this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna block that power. So I'm gonna put this in right close to the edge where we're gonna hook up the, the, the line in. See, this is in, so this will be plus, and then we'll have minus, and then we'll have ground. Okay, you, you, you asked me, I'm sure you're asking, how is he gonna make that balance? It looks like unbalanced to me. Well, we're going to do impedance balancing. So the, this input resistor has, uh, or capacitor, let, let me move it over. This input capacitor has, feeds a 10K to ground. That's your, that's your filter, okay? So it filters DC at, uh, what was that calculation? Somewhere around half a hertz or something like that. So this is a 2.2 K. This is a 10 K, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0. Brown time means a 1%. So I'm gonna put this uh, flat like this because there's plenty of room on this. Put that in here and that'll feed this way. So this will be Plus, minus, and that'll be ground. I'll show you when I'm done. <laughs> and then that capacitor feeds another, exactly the same, reversed. And this provides uh, output loading for the FET in the capsule here. This, this resistor here and this capacitor blocks any DC that's on, uh, that, any charge that is on the output. So you only have AC output or just audio, clear, plain audio. So this also blocks it at the same rate. Okay, there's the ground. And, uh, and this goes to here. Oops, goes the other way, make the plus. So we're, we're hooking these up. So the minus is to the minus, see that? This minus, the minus of this electrolytic is to the minus of this one. Mm -hmm. 
with the resistor connected to where they connect both together. Then we have another 10K output of the capsule. Simple as that. Okay, that's a, yeah, that's 10K. And that feeds straight to ground there too. So I'm going to, to go piggyback right over here and go straight to ground here. These two guys go on to ground. Now the input side, the other side of the capsule is uh, we've got power supply, power supply, and a diode LED. This is, these are 2.2K. They go together at the switch. All right. So I'm going to put them up here side by side at this side of the board. Give it some space. These go together and that goes to an LED. Yes, yes, yes. This goes to the switch, the power, and the battery goes into there. I mean, this is simple as, this is crazy simple. All right, there we go. So I'm gonna solder those in. I'm gonna hook, I'm gonna, for hookup wire, you can use, just open up some old Cat 5, Cat 6, whatever, cat, you know, the uh, LAN cable. You can strip the, uh, strip the stuff off of it here. And use this for, for hookup wire in, the, in, your, in your little system. So, now, now to the boring part of me soldering. You see me solder here? Back this up a little bit. Bring my iron over this way. And you see me solder here. Ah, lovely tea. Ah, there we go. So I'm gonna hook the LED up too. All right, I'm gonna get from the top to secure the components on the board since I have these lovely through hole platings. Oh, nice. Secure these in, and then I can do, do with the bottom whatever I want. <laughs> Thank you.